is a field reporter named after the amount of people I performed oral sex on in one night in 2012. <laughs> Hello, I'm 50? In one? That can't be right. There was a party that I went to. <laughs> what? They had parties underneath a supermarket in Brooklyn. <laughs> I guess that's the end of the sentence. Let's see. A knockoff Simon and Garfunkel. Um, well, they did the one about the bridge. <laughs> um, this is about a tunnel. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> It's a hole, it's, it's a big, big old hole in the ground <laughs> Where the cars make their sound <laughs> Little people going to work and back Back and forth <laughs> Back and forth Inside a little hole in the ground Forth and back <laughs> Back and forth <laughs> Forth and back <laughs> In New York <laughs> In bacon, egg, and cheese. <laughs> Almost forgot. Old fashioned. Cheers, guys. Cheers. Everyone gives Florida shit, and Ohio fucks up way harder than anyone else. No. Fuck Ohio, is my point. Uh, uh, cedar point. Oh, Allie, what's the strategy? <laughs> Rip it. Little bits at a time. Yeah, that's what I do. Alley. Oh. I'm pretending it's cheese. <laughs> Put the whole thing in there and soak it. No. Soak it in your spit. Ugh. You Let don't it... know how wet my mouth is. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know anything about me. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> it like... tastes like Staples, the store. <laughs> Lick the bottom of my fucking shoe. <laughs> and send their souls to hell. Uh, yes, yes, in due time. By... <laughs> now to the ice cream shop. Oh. Alley. Okay, so I got top surgery and I made a soup list and all my friends signed up to bring me soup and it was very nice and every one of the nice. writers came and brought me soup, but it ended up being too much soup. So I put some of the soup in the freezer and then I had to move and it's crazy to move with soup. So I had to throw a ton of it out. Hey. <laughs> and this is like nine people's worth of homemade soup in my trash can. As punishment, Grant has to reenact the position he was in when his father walked in on him. And... Brennan, you play his father. Thanks for watching. So anyway, it was sort of like that. I love you, son. <laughs> I love you too, Dad. <laughs> Looks like you got your hog in your mouth a little bit. <laughs> oh, very little bit. It was really more of a tongue than anything else. I, I was gonna say, even if you kind of get where you need to go, is your body in a position where we can actually kind of get any business done here? Yeah, you know, really, it's more the thought experiment of it all. Yeah, yeah, I bet. I sure. bet, kiddo. Well, I'm proud of you, and I hope someday you do work that makes you feel proud too. <laughs> ...with this Harvestman stuff. She nods and says, <laughs> Excuse you. Many apologies. <laughs> Brennan, your last prompt, I'm sorry about this in advance. Predictive text, Brennan. Hey gang, absolutely to 100% happy to be here. Number one thing is that everyone to take care of yourself. Predictably, you might find another time. And with the philosophy camp counselor, this time around we go back, and I'm telling you right now, I won't stand for it. Gang, you gotta be drinking water. I had large Irish Catholic family. Gandalf the white, Gandalf the gray. We all have a responsibility to examine our place in the world. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. We super duper appreciate it. Happy hippie hokey time time time. Incredible. We go to Chunch Cucumbers. Chunch? Thanks, Grum. If you're a fan of the Transformers movie, you're shit out of luck because I'm gonna talk about Call Me By Your Name. Be 
big news for the peach that got fucked by Timothy Chalamet. This lovable bundle of juice is set to star in the remake of American Pie 2 in the role of the pie. That's right, they're only remaking the second one. Also, Streep alert, Streep alert, Meryl Streep feast tonight. <laughs> Hide your children and hang a bow, a fresh rosemary over your door. Streep season is upon us. Streep will feast on the bones of the unworthy. Fear and glory to Streep. I'll go with you, but I have old to say- Old people crew, what's up? Great, <laughs> uh, uh, so the old people crew, Ricky- Okay, two lesbians named Jen and Karen lived in a tiny little apartment in Los Angeles with their little chihuahua. Wait, Jess, this is you. <laughs> Two lesbians <laughs> lost their beloved chihuahua in a weird desert accident. I love you so I love much. You so much I love you I so much. Gay power. Gay power. I've broken Grant O'Brien. Oh I've broken him down. Oh He's a little putty in my hand. Do whatever you no. want to me. <laughs> we, we start dating. <laughs>